Hey there guys, and welcome back to Papers, Please. So, in the last episode, um, I'm actually not sure what I did in the last episode. It's been a couple days since I've last played this game, and I actually have not rendered the previous episode yet. It's not even in my video editor just yet. But, we are currently sitting on day 26, so only a few more days, and then we will be done with our first playthrough of this game. I'm excited! Also, the Ministry of Health acts to protect citizens, new policies, safeguards at borders, which is a plus. I like to be safeguarded, you know, I like having extra guards guarding me, and uh, let's just guard on to work, I guess. Not quite sure where I'm trying to go with this whole guard uh, mnemonic thing here, but uh, if my game could continue going to doing it the thing it's supposed to be doing, that would be great. Almost Christmas too, I'm liking it, I'm liking it a lot. Alright, Inspector, the risk of disease is too great. A new protocol has been instituted. All entrants must carry a valid certificate of vaccination with an up-to-date polio vaccine. I'm down for this. This requirement extends to natives, foreigners, diplomats, and asylum seekers. Continued on the back. United Federation citizens are permitted entry as such with such certification. Continue to confiscate our Saskan passports from residents living in Altan District. Glory towards Saska. And then we have our usual wanted criminals and the news. So we're looking for uh, Bob Head. Pigtail Lady and um, Artsaska Lady, Cheekbone Lady. I I don't even know. I don't even know. So I'm gonna put my key down. I'm gonna put this key over here because I'm never gonna use that ever. And let's pull up a rulebook. So since it has been a little while, let's do a quick uh, review of our uh, memory mnemonics here. So for, for Collecta, we have "You're very welcomed." So you're very welcome. Uh, let's see here. Pull up our map. Uh, Old El Paso for Stoska. We have uh, very, what was it? Energetic Hot Tomatoes for Impor. Uh, United Federation was what? Good Spicy Ketchup. Great Spicy Ketchup or good. It's uh, They're both G's, so that's fine. Uh, Republia was Tickle Little Boys. Tickle Little Boys is indeed correct. Oberstan is Silly Little Man. And Antigria was Glorious Stinky Outhouse, I believe? Stinky Glorious Outhouse. Yes, it was. Okay. This is why we create the memory mnemonics, even though that it has been a couple days since I've last played this game, I still vaguely remember what they are supposed to be. So let's go ahead and get this day started. Papers, please. Thank you. Okay, he is vaccinated. And it is for the correct ID. He's visiting. For 90 days, he is balding, he has 65 kilograms, he is the right height, he is none of the people they're looking for. Uh, the names seem a okay. Visiting for 3 months is what I believe he said. 90 days, actually this seems uh, perfectly a okay. And to your outer grouse is fine, and I don't see anything else wrong with it, so let's go ahead and approve. You can have your entry permit back, you can have this back, this is not expired. And there you are. Cause no trouble. Oh, shit. Wait, no, no, we're fine, we're fine. For a minute there, I thought he didn't have his vaccination paper, and I kind of panicked a little bit. Whew, I'm not used to this. Uh, you do not have things for polio. Uh, so we need to go to the rule book, and where's your polio? Not this one, this one, please, thank you. So where is, uh, we want to deny him, and we want to snap a reason. So there you are. There you are, there you are, and there you are. Uh, is there anything else? This too. So much paper. We're, we're like, what, five sheets of paperwork for workers now? That is insane. Alright, so papers please. Uh, you are missing things. Where's your entry permit? Do I know Sergio? You said you were a friend. That would help. Um, please, my family is gone. I only have Sergio left. Um, you don't have required documentation. I tried for so long. They would not allow me to leave. Um. Yeah. Um. I have bad news about Sergio. He was killed. I'm sorry. Aww. Well, now I, feel even, I feel doubly bad now that Sergio's dead. It's my fault, too. Well, more specifically, it's because of the stupid double clicking thing, but. Get me out of inspection mode. Okay, she is visiting for 30 days. Long hair, it is not expired. Weight and height seem okay. The hair is a little bit daunting. Um, she 
Sand month, right? Yes. Olga McTuggan seems fine. Boston is an issuing city. Enterprise date is also okay. Long hair, I think, counts towards this. Um, let's just check, just to be safe. Long hair. Yeah, perfectly fine. So let's go ahead and improve. Um, wait, 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 wait. Something's missing. Something's missing. Where's the polio? I cannot afford... Okay, so we're going to deny and reason and the, uh, denied will overwrite my accidental approval there. So get out of my booth. I do not wish for any of your polio potentiality here. So, papers please. Thank you. Alright, he is good for polio. He's in transit. And numbers match up. Joshua Kun Kunowalski. 14 days. I'm glad my papers are in order. Well, they better be in order. So let's see. Weight and height seem alright. Um, Joshua Kunowalski. Numbers match up. Transiting for two weeks. That is correct. United Federation. Great Rapid is an issuing city. And he is none of the people that we're looking for. So let's go ahead and approve him. There you are. There you are. And there you are. And this too. Cause no trouble. And hopefully there's nothing wrong with that. Because anytime there's flavor text, it's a good, there's a good risk that there's going to be something wrong with it. Polio is fine. Visiting friends for, uh, what? Okay, that's not right. How do I do this? Um, it's this one. This is not right. Duration. Duration, please, thank you. Uh, alright, it'll be one month. He's lying. Uh, but whatever, um, I'm a little bit perplexed now. ID numbers are correct. That seems perfectly fine. Uh, Interbody date is also okay, Matthias. Shingleton is an issue in the city, and Killer Cyburns is an accurate description of him. So let's go ahead and approve him. There, there, there. Hopefully there's nothing else wrong, because there is potential for that. The more paperwork there is, the harder it is to make sure you get everything correct. Apparently there's a, um, uh, let me finish, let me check this person first before I get into that next uh, little thought here. He, she is from Alatan, so we are going to have to confiscate her passport. Weight and height seem okay, birthdates match up, and the IDs also match up. So what we are going to do is we're going to put that inside the drawer, and we are going to approve this. There you are, there, and there you are. And uh, what was I getting at here? I was getting at something, and I don't remember what it is anymore, because I was just talking about it like five seconds ago. Oh, that's terrible. That is absolutely terrible. Oh, that's right. There is an achievement for this game where if, if you complete the entire game without getting a single citation, which is really, really hard. Uh, staying for a couple weeks. Okay. Uh oh Get, get out of your... Out this. Get in there. Get out of there. Get out of there. Get out of there. You think you can muck up my checkpoint like that? Huh? Okay, I can't feel anything in my being at all. That was not a good day. That was not a good day. We did fairly poorly. We got, uh... uh maybe not. We, um, actually made money today, which is... rare. Considering how slow I was processing those people, that is very rare. I mean, the, the sharpshooter and the tame ones basically make up for the terrible day we've had. We've only processed seven people, but uh, we didn't get any citations, which is kind of nice. At least I don't recall receiving any citations. And everyone is alive and well. At the very least, I'm getting better at shooting people, which is also a nice significant plus. So, in the next episode, uh, we have only, I think, five more days. 27, and the last day is 31. So, until next time, thank you guys so very much for watching. I hope you're having a fantastic day.